What is going on, everyone? It's it's early in the morning. It's 1 a.m. or late at night, whatever you want to call it. I was going to keep this video and implement it with the next Flyers game, which is technically tonight against the Ottawa Senators. But we'll just go ahead and talk about it. Jake Voracek was suspended for two games on that hit against Johnny Boychuk, and I'm sorry, I just don't see it. I normally am, I always am, not normally, I always am pretty good when it comes to taking off the biased glasses and looking at this with just a, a normal mindset as a fan of the game. And if it was brutal of a hit, I would say it was brutal of a hit and very deserving of a suspension, but that wasn't. And it's just the inconsistency of the NHL and when it comes down to hammering on guys it's it's all over the place no one knows it doesn't make sense uh, of Denny Malkin a repeat offender swings his stick at Michael Raffle's face and he gets one game Jack Eichel had a pretty brutal hit the other night right to the head he gets suspended two games Voracek gets two games for just putting his back into someone interference yes Suspended two games, way too harsh. Way too harsh. And and keep in mind that he's not a repeat offender. He has a really clean resume. I'm sorry, but they butchered this one pretty badly. And it doesn't kill me or crush me inside understanding how far of a stretch it is for this Flyers team to really make a push and, and make the playoffs. But this is a pretty crucial time for this Flyers team if they were to make a run, if they were to do this thing. Now, keep in mind, I say that very, 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 very loosely, understanding our situation. But if you take a look at it, at least Game 1 is against Ottawa. Hopefully, we can get it done without Jake Voracek. But this is a key piece for this team to, to kind of stay hot. And you lose Jake Voracek, and we just saw how meaningful he really was to the lineup him and Nolan Patrick were out for a little bit of time with the lower body injury specifically to Voracek he comes back and he's an emotional leader with a big night with multiple points multiple assists and now you take that away from the Flyers I want to know your thoughts down below there's not much to it other than I, I disagree completely with it it was an interference there's no reason for him to get the same harsh criticism uh, not criticism but but there's no way he should have a two-game suspension and you give Malkin one for literally throwing a stick in Raffle's face or that Eichel hit that came down the same day today. And I can go on and on and on. The problem is nobody knows. The problem is the inconsistency of the National Hockey League when it comes to putting the hammer down on guys for, for what they do out there on the ice. I'm sorry, I, I just don't see this one. It's a little disappointing, but at the same time, like I said, it's not gonna it's not gonna keep me up at night just because I know how slim the chances are for the Flyers to really do this thing. Let me know what you think down below. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.